Hey, dude. Come here, man. Good morning, dude. Good morning, buddy. Come here. Hello. Oh, good morning, man. Good morning, dude. Oh. Today is the big day. Our buddies, Christian and Sholly, are competing up in corporate, well, da down. <laughs> Sorry, this ticks and life, I just don't know the geography just yet. They're competing down in Corpus Christi. It's about three hours away. I'm super excited. I think they're both gonna crush it, even though I think they're actually competing against each other, uh, which it's just gonna be awkward when they both get on stage. I'm like, yeah, go Shaw. Uh, cri Shaw, uh, but we gotta go. There's the champ, dude. What up? Wait, hold on. Let's see it, dude. Let's, let's, let's see the ads, man. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah. Is this lighting? Yeah, it's good, man. Yeah, that's, that's too many. All right. You so shredded, dude. I'm about to break my camera. Looking great, man. So today you're still gonna work out, right? Uh, oh yeah, we're not done. Okay. Act. All right. Damn. Is that what it's like to have muscle? So, I like to be real lean, man. But uh, yeah, we got a quick workout today. Yeah. Upper body circuit. Cardio. Tiny bit of cardio, like five, ten minute warm up, ten, fifteen minutes tops afterwards. You need to rest. And tomorrow's a big day. Yes, sir. Let's do it. It kind of sounds like a stripper's name. It's like, huh. hi, I'm Corpus. Do you want to dance? Do you want to dance? Check out the hotel room. Nice little king size bed for me and my small knees. Then we got, you know, of course the bathroom. Oh my gosh, so nice. We got a micro wave. Check this out, guys. <clears throat> my body was like, oh, your skin's been super nice. <laughs> oh, you're about to go to the Caymans and you're just flawless in your skin. Not anymore, bitch. Here's some pimples, but. Let's go see what Christian's up to. What up? Hey, dude. Hey, hey dude. Hey, dude. Damn, I miss him already. Got pumped. What are we Hell doing? yeah. Coming in clutch. Is final workout? Had final. It's just a little pump session, man. It's not really a, <clears throat> yesterday was kind of the final one. Just a little pump doesn't mean that we're involved. Just, just trying to do a Drake reference there. Just, you know? All right, let's, let's go work out. <laughs> So white. Here we have Christian Guzman, standing at 5 foot 11 and weighing 170 pounds of rock hard muscle. This weekend he will compete at the Battle of the Bay for the title of men's NPC champion. His determination and dedication over the past few months of prep has been unparalleled and nothing will stand in his way of chasing the gold. Unless of course there are some dudes who just like have better genetics who are competing against him and maybe have a little bit more muscle mass or like the judges just kind of prefer a different body type or something like that. Christian is known as an internet sensation with over 2 million followers across all platforms. He is known for motivating, inspiring, and being a role model for people of all ages. He is also known for very intense workout faces and sweating excessively while in the gym. At any given time, Christian has 2 to 14 cameramen documenting his every move. Whether that's making oatmeal in slow motion or buying some new pants, they capture every moment to share it to the world. The alpha male is also in a happy relationship with a tiny little buff bunny. Together, they dominate the industry and make everyone jealous of how gosh darn cute they are. As Christian finishes his workout, he takes one last look into the mirror to ensure he is in absolute peak shape. The work is done. Now it is in the hands of the judges that will score his physique as he walks across the stage. There is nothing else he can do except rest, wait, and hope they don't deduct points for small calves. Best of luck, Christian Guzman. Best of luck. 
course it. It's humidity, man. Stop. Stop. Big day. Big day. How you feeling, man? A little rough, but good. I'm excited. I'm just really excited. I'm just got to wake up. Got to wake up. Done. I'm done. I'm back. How you feel? I'm not ruining the, like, I feel the, like the a placement complete, or anything. I just feel like a, I feel like I'm back. Yeah. I feel, like, I feel like I just haven't been me, you know? I feel like all it takes is like for that to be done and now I'm already back. When I compete in powerlifting, like after I'm done, like I, I don't really know I I don't like know what to do. Like I, I with like my training and stuff, because I'm like, okay, I peaked on strength, and I kinda just like I feel like I lose it all right after. Is that the same after like bodybuilding? Like do yeah. you, do you you have the same intensity as soon as you back at the gym? 100%. Or? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Actually, honestly, like the next like three, four weeks, I'm going to look pretty bad. When you look crazy in the gym, I have better workouts. So I'm going to yeah, add that. But, and I'm going to be like just gaining strength so quick. Yeah. Because I've lost so much. So like it comes back so quick. Uh, especially when like the food's like much higher and stuff like that. So I, I just really want to grow. Like, I don't want to be ever, I don't want to ever have to diet again and be under 170. So I need to put some really? muscle on. Yeah. And you're only going to compete like the one, like, each year it's once. I don't even know if I'm going to compete next year. I mean, that's not for sure or anything. I just want to gain more muscle. Like, I enjoy it, but I also want to hit a 405 bench. What are you at now? 365? Uh, I've I definitely, I, like with Mark Bell, I think I did 360, but like, I think I could probably do a little more. We're not like at peak strength, you know? So, competition's over. Just business work, focusing on? Business work. I guess like physique goals. Yeah. I, I mean, you know, when I'm bulking up, I like force myself to, I, I like force feed myself. Yeah. Just try to get like really, really big and heavy. But like, if I can find a sweet spot where I, I've never like just kind of like maintained a leaner physique while like gaining. And I always just try to go super extreme so I can like rush for the next summer shredding. Well, you know? it's, it's nice now you don't have to like, like I feel like recently, like everything has been so focused on like, what can you eat? When can you eat? When can I train? How long is my training? Am I, is my training like as optimal as it can be? Where now you can kind of like focus on like everything else that's important. Using my energy, like I would just have to use my energy that I had and allocate it to like a few hours of the day, and yeah. then the whole other the rest of the day was. Just He's like, been like miserable. I mean, I've never experienced like hanging out with him on prep. Like I, I've like known him for a long time, and I've, I've you know known him through preps, but I physically being here in Texas and we hang out every single day. Obviously, we see each other every single day. Um, but like, yeah, the last couple weeks, suck. like, you just, yeah, it's lame. It, it, it's just like once you hit that body. And it, honestly, the previous years weren't that bad. But it's, it's like the leaner you, know, you get, like actual body, and the longer you stay there, it's it's good though. Like anytime I was like, let's go eat, like he was very like he didn't. It's it's almost like he wanted to just like stay in the house, like did not do not go do anything because it's like he just like was like focusing on that. Yeah. But it's good man. to challenge stuff like that. But now it's. I'm so happy. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm back. Now it's back. Like the I'm right. back. Did you have you told people about the the thing you're gonna you might get the big the big it's gonna break like break us up a little bit. Oh no 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 because no there's no it's still up in the air. No, we'll leave that as a mystery. Yeah, yeah. But proud of you, bro. Get some dinner Look tomorrow. Yeah. My feet are like you see that? They're so I'm swollen. I'm doing it. I'm getting a pedicure tomorrow. 9.30, man a manicure. Yeah. <laughs> 9.30 on a Monday, got nothing better to do. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go home, uh, two doors down. Yeah. Oh. Hey, dude! Hey, dude! Hey, man! Hey, buddy! Hey, dude! Oh, oh! Hey, hey, man! Oh, hey, dude! Oh. Did you miss me, man? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Dude. I'm here, man. Calm down. I'm here. Hello. Oh. Hey. <laughs> this is what dude and Ava do all day. They literally just sneeze on each other, attack each other. Dude usually treats Ava as like an armadillo and just like grabs her by her neck, but she she's into some weird kinky stuff and like she like likes it. I don't know. Like, what are you doing, dude? Yep. There's, oh, there's Got the attack. <laughs> like, what are you...
Just trying to kick her with the back. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? They love it. It's weird. They're in some masochist stuff right there for sure. Good boy. You want to go to the dog park, dude? You want to go to the dog park, dude? Okay, go away. Read some books. Okay, or just sniff some ass. So I love taking dude to the dog park, but it is just getting hotter and hotter here in the Texas summer heat. It's like 95 degrees. My goddamn, if I was wearing my cowboy boots, I'd be sweating them things off. Dude, come here. Come here. Hey, dude. Hey. Oh, okay. All the dogs are chasing me now. Oh, God. Help. Help. Dude, I'm not going to lie. How your calves look right now, that's how I look all the time. Yeah. Feels bad, doesn't it? So obviously dude gets really excited at the dog park, but I have learned that when I walk him with the harness, he does like 99.9% .9 better than with a leash. Like he's kind of pulling right now as you can see, and like he never pulls when I have a leash. So if your dog pulls a lot when you walk, sorry about the wind, this really blows. Uh, yeah, get a harness with a front mounted attachment. It's the best thing ever. Hey man, you want a puppuccino, dude? Yeah. Come on, woof woof. Oh. Go away! I gotta stop using that. Go away, read some books, but it's just so fun to say. Say with me, all right? Come on, come on. Right out of your computer or your phone. Go away! Read some books! I know, Becky, but listen, I just went to Starbs and I got the green peach citrus white tea and I told them biatches, I was like, look, can you not put any sweetener and just use Splenda? Because honestly, these little waist trimmers from Sweet Sweat are just not working. Like, I'm sweating a lot, but I'm just still like, I just hate my body. <laughs> okay, bitch. See you later. Dude! Woof! 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How you like that, dude? How you like that, dude? Whenever I want to get dude a puppuccino, I always have to buy something, and I don't want anything from Starbucks. I never, I don't, if you didn't know, I don't drink coffee. I've probably had like less than 10 coffees, probably like six to seven and a half coffees in my entire life. I just don't really like the lingering taste in, your, in my mouth. I don't know. I've just never been a coffee person. I don't buy Starbucks. So I got this peach citrus white tea with, uh, it was 45 calories, and I was like, ha, too many cows for me because we don't drink our calories unless we're drinking our calories. You know, it's, it's, it's alcohol, by the way. Not bad. Hey, dude. You sleepy man. Are you ready to go to bed, man? All right, so that will conclude the video. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you could take two seconds out of your busy day and smash the thumbs up button, I would appreciate it. I know the footage was kind of all over the place, but I really didn't film much. I just wanted to support Christian and Shawley. And uh, as much as I, you know, poke fun at, you know, the how big of my biceps bodybuilding kind of thing, uh, I think it's awesome that they put their mind to something, they stuck to it, and they went out there and they crushed it. They brought their best package. And uh, now I can get my friends back. Uh, this whole like prep life is finally over and like I said if you want to check out the show results I don't want to be the one to spoil it so check out Christian and Shawley's channel in the description thank you guys I got some really cool content I'm filming this week we go to Cayman's next week but we'll talk about that soon thank you peace out woof woof bark bark goodbye